Hello guys, welcome back in my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about how to publish app on Google Play Store. So let's be started. You're a superhero. So open your Google Play Console account. This is my Google Play Console account, and uh, the, uh, just open this. After open this, you getting this pin verification option. So you need to uh, verify this your pin. You need to add your PAN card and add your basic details. Then your account is verified successfully. Then you get this mail ID. Okay. So my account is verified successfully. After verified, you need to open uh, this all apps option. Then you need to create. Uh, click on create app. So before publishing your application on Play Store, you need these information all like AV files and uh, logo app logo. So app logo is here. You can see this this is my app logo which size is 512 and 512 height and width and uh, one I need to banner image to so you can create your banner image from Canva websites also this is my banner image for uh, my play console the, which size is not uh, correct size so I just download my banner image and uh, just uh, we need to resize this so I just open my paint this is the Canva all uh, you can see this all here you can choose anyone according to your need and according to your templates uh, this is the all free and paid both available so I open just my paint and uh, I need to resize my image all so I just uh, copy here and crop and resize click on untick and tick okay so horizontal size is uh, 1024 and vertical size is 500 this is size of 1024 and 500 height and width this is our image for play console banner image so just copy this my location i won't put here my location save as and you can just change your banner uh, this image name also so i just uh, put uh, put this name banner.png just click on save okay so our just uh, our image also uh, created successfully and now i need to have uh, one if screenshots you can see this you can use this uh, websites for creating this uh, screenshots also and uh, you can get this uh, download option click on download png and free okay so our image is downloaded downloaded now here gif format you can get a uh, gif format image click on right click extract here and ok our image is extracted here just open you can see this here and uh, this is my screenshot of my application just call, cut here and paste it here my all file is in this uh, folders uh, like uh, av files uh, screenshots banners and logo images here it all my files and also need our application name banners or short descriptions long descriptions uh, email id and uh, email id and uh, privacy policy for my play console if you don't know how to get a privacy policy and how to generate privacy policy for application then you can get a uh, uh, in i in descriptions also i have given that uh, link you can just open and create your own privacy policy for your application so just uh, click on create app and now need to fill up all the informations here so just app name i need to uh, add my app name just click on copy and app name paste here and default language is en and us so just click on uh, here and uh, choose en us select your app or game if your app is app or game then choose according to your application my app is app not a game and my app is also free so i just choose free and go below and select these three options also if you are uh, first time then you will get three options for tick here if you are uh, already first or two app then you will get only two options for tick okay then just click on create this is the app dashboard option okay this is very mandatory part of your and this is first is start testing don't do anything in start testing now just click on set up your app expand this expand this height section 
and you need to fill up all the sections here okay so first we need to set up privacy policy you can get this uh, update so don't worry just uh, up uh, upload this privacy policy url here i have already created my privacy policy url just copy your url uh, privacy policy url i just copied and paste it here click on save uh, this part is uh, uh, successfully done now again we need to add second option app access part click on first option all functionality is available without special access click on save and again going to dashboard click on ads if you if you in your app have ads then click on as or not then click on no then click on save my app have already ads so i just click yes okay again click on here and the content rating part is start questionnaire click on start questionnaire and add your email id you can add anyone your email id just uh, i have this my email id i just copied my email id and paste it here category choose according to your application so my app is uh, belong to this category so just select this and click on next option download app uh, you can uh, just read your these all the questions but i have already read all the questions so i just uh, select this no no option okay you can select according to you filhal uh, sorry you can add this click on next and submit okay this content rating and questionnaire part is done so again going to the dashboard option click on target audience and choose according to your uh, app can app uh, uh, age related so children's your application is appeal to children just click on no and click on save next option and click on save my target audience and content rating part is also done now again going to news app click on news app if your application is news then click on as otherwise if your application is no news then you just click no and uh, click on save options okay so again going to be dashboard uh, this is our second uh, uh, next part covid 19 tracing related so just click on uh, last options tick this and click on save options again going to be dashboard uh, our next steps is data safety part this is very important part if you are first time then you will get this next next option just click on next next otherwise you will get these option again uh, data safety direct uh, dashboard part okay so don't worry just click on here and data collection and security options you will get some questions but just click on no if you have some uh, data safety related any permission then again click on no then proceed okay don't worry if you get any issue then you will set this uh, after some time then again going to be next part and app category choose app uh, choose a category according to your application so my application belong to be personalization just uh, select this and uh, also choose tag according to your category so i just apply and uh, you need to add your email address also again here uh, and the phone number and website is also not mandatory just is, this is also optional so don't worry just click on save okay store setting part is completed now again going to be dashboard scroll bar down again and then you will get uh, last part store listing part okay uh, store listing part is uh, very important so just wait after two or three seconds then you will get your store setting listing part you need to add your app name logo screen source banner image and these all information here okay see here so i just need to add here and uh, my app name is already given here and uh, short description already man i have right here just copy our uh, just copy your short descriptions and paste it to your short description here full descriptions also i have uh, right here just copy and paste here if you are first time then don't do don't do write more uh, four to five lines just uh, add uh, very very small lines so, 
सो यू नीड टू एड योर लोगो हियर आल्सो सो माय लोगो इज इन दिस दिस डायरेक्टरी जस्ट कॉपी आवर डायरेक्टरी यू कैन आल्सो ड्रैग एंड ड्रॉप एंड अपलोड हियर माय लोगो इज हियर जस्ट ओपन इट हियर एंड फीचर्ड ग्राफिक यू कैन सी बैनर इमेज आल्सो इट्स साइज टेन ट्वेंटी फोर एंड फाइव हंड्रेड हाइट एंड वेथ आई जस्ट ओपन दिस माय बैनर इमेज लोकेशन एंड सेलेक्ट माय बैनर ओपन एंड स्क्रीन शॉट आल्सो अपलोड यू नीड हियर क्लिक ऑन अपलोड एंड माय स्क्रीन शॉट दिज ऑल माय स्क्रीन शॉट यू नीड टू एड मिनिमम टू स्क्रीन शॉट एंड मैक्सिमम एट स्क्रीन शॉट दैट मीन्स फोन स्क्रीन शॉट यू नीड टू एड हियर अपलोड एंड सेलेक्ट एंड ओपन दिस माई ऑल स्क्रीन शॉट हियर यू कैन ड्रैग एंड ड्रॉप ऑल्सो एंड यू कैन कस्टमाइज दिस दिस इज मैंडेटरी पार्ट फॉर यू यू नीड टू फोन स्क्रीन शॉट एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो अपलोड योर बैनर इमेज इन स्क्रीन शॉट ऑल्सो लाइक अ टैबलेट स्क्रीन शॉट यू कैन अपलोड दिस इज ऑप्शनल फॉर यू नॉट मैंडेटरी ओके so i just up upload here if you want to upload tablet screen shot just upload and uh, i have just upload this banner image you can upload this is optional for you not mandatory so if you want then do otherwise no issue okay then again click on save option my all uh, information is to fill up now click on save okay this is save now again going to be dashboard ओके नाउ माई दिस पार्ट इज कम्प्लीटेड नाउ अगेन गोइंग टू बी लास्ट ऑप्शन पब्लिश योर ऐप ऑन गूगल प्ले एक्सपेंड दिस एंड सेलेक्ट कंट्री एंड रेजिन क्लिक ऑन हियर एंड एड कंट्री और रेजिन क्लिक ऑन हियर एंड क्लिक दिस एंड एड कंट्री रेजिन दैन यू दैन ऑल कंट्रीज सेलेक्टेड हियर सक्सेसफुली अगेन क्लिक ऑन क्रिएट न्यू रिलीज नाउ वी नीड टू एड माई आवर ए वी फाइल ओके so this is my av file you can generate your av file from your android studio or anywhere which you make your applications okay so my av file location is this i just select my av file okay this is uploading time uh, it's a take approximate appro uh, depends on your application size so just wait for that and uh, release notes you can add your uh, short description also if you are first time otherwise you will update your application then you can add your app updates and add features bug fixed anything you can add here in release notes okay so i just add this and wait for some time for app release av file uploaded you can get this uh, one app bundle uploaded successfully okay after getting this you will get save option enable click on save and click on review release if you if you, uh, in your application have some issue then you will get error otherwise click on roll out option and successfully roll out our application is successfully roll out if you get any warning then don't worry this is only warning and no problem with that warning okay our application is successfully published and after two week your app will live on play store and the second more things uh, most important thing that in your application have any login issue so you will get uh, this option go to app content option app access and click on here again click on add new instruction you need to add your phone number or password otherwise in your application have any login detail you can see this in my application have email id and password login detail so i need to add email id and password that email id and password which i log in this okay so first i register this let's click on register now this is my application which i uploaded on play store and uh, email id you need to add your correct email id and password you can choose according to you so i just uh, add my password 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 one password you can just choose for demo i just register this you can see successfully registered again click on login and again check your email id and password that email id and password correct or not that email id and password the login successfully or not you can see this i login with same mail id and password you can see this my application successfully login okay so i need again email id and password put on our play store 
so this is our uh, basic information mainly authentication related so i just uh, type here name app login anything you can type here you can see you can just type app login detail here okay and then uh, username uh, in your application have any phone number login and password login then you need to add your phone number and password for login and uh, correct phone number and correct password for login not for register only login okay so be remember this point because google check uh, with uh, this mail id and password for login okay not uh, they register only they will login only i hope you getting my point and uh, click on apply and click on save only this option is uh, perfect okay so our uh, login authentication is successfully i have added here and all thing is done now again going to all app this is my app in review update status is in review and after app live you will get your status in uh, uploaded on the production mode uh, after two week approximate maximum time it will take two week because our app is first time so it's take two week and after live app you will get notification that your app is live on play store so guys if you have any questions or query related application or any application you can contact me in my instagram also i hope you will get all the informations here thank you